Hello friends, welcome to Programming by Zot YouTube channel. In this HTML5 tutorial series lecture, we are going to discuss about drag and drop API. So what actually drag and drop API is? This is two files I have uh, grabbed here. First of all, this is index.html which contains nothing. We are going to write here our HTML5 code of drag drop API. And this is the image we are going to use in order to drag and drop it inside a div tag. So uh, before we start it, this is a self promotion, shame, uh, actually shameless self promotion as well. You guys can call it. This is my YouTube channel, Programming by Zart. Please subscribe it and uh, share it with your community because I am going to put out a lot of tutorials about web app development, penetration testing. Uh, software development, desktop application development, and also kernel relating. Either it is Linux or desktop. So uh, let's now go ahead and start our stuff. This is the basic skeleton of our HTML5 document. HTML. Okay. Drag, drop, copy, XAMPL. Let's complete it because this is not a complete skeleton. We are going to use in style. We are going to style something script there. We are going to basically write out our functions, a couple of functions. Then we need a div and we also need an image. Okay, this image tag what actually is doing. We are going to set an image here and going ahead and dragging it out inside the div tag. So in order to do that, we have to set IDs of both tags in order to access them. This is div1 and let's set it out here ID equals uh, image1. Okay. Now in order to make an image draggable, we have to specify the tag attribute draggable equals 2. Now we have to set out the height and width as well. So actually height I am going to set here 100 and width is uh, 300 pixel. Okay, now I am going to write here something about div. Because we have to make div uh, more professional so that we drag it and we can see actually uh, what is happening behind all this uh, let's quickly set its height to uh, 100 pixel the same and width to 300 pixel okay let's make its border border uh, one pixel so uh, this would be solid let's set it to black okay now uh, I have this image here called image.png so let's use it and now we are going to open our index.html in Firefox so that we can see how it looks okay now we have to set here div properties so that we can see how it exactly looks like break row and this is our div one okay so this is how it looks like now we have to make this image draggable actually it is draggable but not droppable because when we come here the uh, actually cursor sign shows that something is not right and this thing is not able to drop dot here so in order to allow dropping we have to create a drop uh, allow drop function here function allow drop and in body what we have to do argument dot print default now let's check still something is not right because here we have an created uh, on drop over event handler on drop over allow dropping 
of the event okay now go ahead and check nothing seems right because actually we have to make it on drag start event on drag start event what you have to do drag this image okay now we have to create a drag function as well that is going ahead and allowing us to drag this image from here so function uh, drag and let's uh, argument dot data transfer this is actually api calls which i am going to use in order to make my image drag and drop able dot uh, set data actually we are going to set some data that is uh, draggable so argument dot uh, target dot id so this is our target image and this is its id that is going to be set as draggable okay uh, now we look at here and still nothing seems right so we why uh, it happens because we haven't made any draw function yet so uh, here would be our draw function on drop call the draw function with its event all right uh, seems fine let's create our uh, draw function and prevent default okay now get the data we have set here and store it inside this data variable oops actually this is here data dot get data of text which we have set here okay now uh, what we have to do is argument dot target dot pen chart okay now what exactly this uh, function will do this will go ahead and append our image to this tick tag i think uh, this is a bit confusing but i promise when we are going to run it you will be clear your mind will be uh, able to easily understand now what we have to set here document oops, dot get element by id and at id we are going to set the data we have recovered here okay now let's uh, refresh our page and try to drag and drop Oops. still something is missing so uh, what is missing let's quickly go ahead and check it out okay we have div as well div is fine and our image is also draggable on drag start we have a drag event and drop event mm. oops my mistake actually mistake is here on drop over should be on drag over. this is what we have to write okay now let's again test it refresh and try to drag okay there we go we have successfully dragged the image from uh, image tag inside edit tag you guys saw it and let's refresh and again test it this is working exactly how we designed it and this is how we can use html5 api so uh, Please subscribe to my channel and share it with your community as well. Hope you guys have enjoyed learning. Thank you for watching.